And um, there was a reason for that. I just all the time after school, I used to come home and I used to use, I used to jam for hours after school. And I would always consider myself to be a very good 2K player. Just like, I don't know, I played that game so much. I love basketball and it was just like, wow. I'm pretty good at this game, man. My record was good, everything. I go to America and I do that. That really puts me on the map. A lot of people find me from that. And then we move on to wages. And wages in 2K20 just... Oh! Wages in 2K20 push that game to a limit that it never should have reached. Just ba It was those wages in 2K20 when my life really started going fucking nuts. I'm going to just say that, okay? The money was flying in. Going from a dude who just had nothing to, to nearly everything, pretty much. Um, I got my mom a new car, I got myself a new car, um, I bought things, everyone was at home and my viewership just jumped from like 2,000 viewers a wager, like it, it jumped to like 20, 30,000, 40,000 in some of the big wages. That was insane, uh, shout out to Aiden and Bronny, that, that whole show that we set up was really big for me and obviously it was for Aiden, it was mad. Um, and then, and then, uh, 2K21 comes out. Let's be real now. Who, who here actually is going to tell me and sit in, my, sit in front of my face and say 2K21 is a great game? Let's be real. The game is not good. I really had to sit down and think about it. That's all I'm going to say, okay? So there's two things I can do here. I can take the short-term 1.2 mil and risk losing a lot of my viewership. Or I can play the long game with Twitch and stay on Twitch. Now, this is the way I see it, okay? You think of a guy like Aiden Ross. Imagine... That game has a ceiling that is impossible to break. I don't care how funny, entertaining, or talented you are. 2K has a ceiling. It's like COD used to have. COD used to have a ceiling before Warzone came out. And that ceiling got broken, okay? But right now, 2K has a ceiling. And you do this, and you make this many albums, all that bullshit. And a lot of artists get fucked over by these labels like that, okay? And it's kind of becoming a thing in gaming. There's a lot of shady gaming deals out there now, too. And it's just becoming crazy. Now, I'm not saying at all that my deal was shady. It was actually an open, good offer. I'm here to announce to you guys that after thinking about everything, after sitting down, and after four months of just being like, what the fuck do I do? By the way, I also had a good break during these four months. I don't want you guys to think that I was just out here shitting that. But after these four months, I have decided that I am going to stay on Twitch. Okay, I've talked to Twitch and they are really keen to keep me on. They want to offer me a custom sort of contract that I can't start there yet. I kind of want to set something big up for the first few days. Um, the blockbuster wages are going to return, okay? I'm on 2K for now, but just hear this, okay? Oh, oh, uh, shit, the lights just went off. Yo, hold on, guys. I need to, I need to, like, walk around to turn my back. Alright, we back, we back. So, uh, what was I saying? Um... <laughs> I either work too much, go out too little, or go out too much and work too little. And last week was a great example, which is why you guys didn't get a midweek video. My vlog was only 30 minutes long because your girl was outside. I mean, I had a great weekend. Um, Sorry about that. We're gonna get started for you today. Who? Hi, um, do you guys have like, I think it's like a Kiwi refresher? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. My name's not Olivia. My cup is gonna say Olivia. Who is that? it for me on Monday and he called me and he was like yeah there were three nails in your tire I'm like where do three nails come from the man on the phone you don't it don't look flat to me I don't really think you should tow it sir mind your business I know for a fact there is no reason other than my tire being messed up thanks see you too yeah the straw that I have is way too small for this cup but we just gonna make a shake um so anyways oh, that was like a terrible um speed bump or women or whatever and she was like we love the outfit and she was just telling me like if I ever need anything to hit her up and I was like yeah I actually need those freaking pants so um let me pay for my parking who why is this man coming over here master bathroom which sucks because sucks because my master bathroom is like beautiful um but because of the way that my shower door opens 
and the lighting in there it's like a very sexy i don't know if you guys have noticed they, like i'm just so used to always having my laptop in bed with me and it made me realize like i don't necessarily need to be on a device before i go to sleep and i didn't think i'd be able to do that so i don't know i just like feel myself changing in really good ways right now and it makes me happy you know it's it's just like the little things that can anyways <laughs> If you're wondering what the fuck I'm wearing and wondering why I'm, I'm dressed like this when it looks like this outside, I will be topping with a very comfy oversized sweater. Quartz? Yeah, let's start there. Perfect. Oh my goodness. Look at these are gorgeous. See, this is more fun. This is what I'm talking about. I love this. Wow. These are all like real marble. Okay. We also have porcelain. <laughs> that thing on the yeah. map. Oh. Here's this again. Yeah, you can see the warmth mm -hmm. throughout it. Perfect. Thank you so much for your help My today pleasure. again. My pleasure. Anytime. You gonna come? Okay. So what are you using to reapply the cement? Yes, it's like a cement. It's like a special mortar. That just sounds like some kind of like dead 